Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and a brand new series. Um, it's breaking news like this that I'm, I'm going to start a new series called Football Today. Um, it's literally just breaking news, fresh news, um, barely, barely old um, bit of news. You might not know, but if you do, then you know what's coming up. Um, big changes in the Premier League today. Um, VAR is in operation as of from next season. Um, I think they're going to start their trial uh, next season. Now, if you're a bit like me, like football all around the world, um, I've seen VAR in operation. Um, I'm a big fan of it. I know some of you are not. I know some of you say it takes time um, and all that. But 11 clubs have voted against it coming in this season. Um, I know there's been a lot of things that we could have used VAR for. But because of the club's vote, they didn't put it in. Um, now, for you guys that don't know what it covers, I'll give you a bit of an idea of what it's going to cover. It covers offside goals, red card, penalties. So if a player dives in the box, VAR picks it up. Um, there's a good chance they upgrade that to a red. That's still yet to come. Um, but it does not cover free kicks, unfortunately. But if it's successful, who knows what we could do with it. Um, and the other bit of news is, I ain't finished with the VAR yet. I'm just going to mention this before I forget. Um, they're going to close the Premier League window for um, one day before the season starts next season. Another early close, sorry about that. Um, VAR, as you can see, you've got all the 20 Premier League clubs behind me. Uh, running um, obviously three of these won't be in the Premier League next season who know who knows who that's not gonna be so I've got all the 20 current Premier League clubs where VAR could possibly be installed next season um, as I've said VAR it's you know it's a decent bit of kit I know as I've just said I know some of you are like it takes time it's a waste I think we had a successful World Cup with VAR, to be honest. Um, you know, and now uh, it's just going to be up to UEFA to see if they bring in the Champions League. Um, as you can tell, I've got the pictures coming up on the screen um, about Raheem Sterling uh, when he tripped himself up and got a penalty. VAR will reverse that decision. Um, I ain't got a picture of it. Cardiff's also a goal against Brighton. Um, VAR will reverse that as well. Uh, Southampton's goal, that's uh, given offside. It weren't offside, the player didn't touch it. VAR, um, you know, there's a lot of things that happens in football now, more than ever, that it's needed for. I'm not going to say it's going to be used in every game. I'm not saying it's a great bit of kit. I'm not saying it don't need tweaking. Personally, I think it needs tweaking just like... But as I've said, I'm a big fan of it. Uh, gives you some uh, suggestions to it. For instance, I was watching an MLS game, which for you that who don't know, it's in American uh, football. Uh, not American football, I call it soccer, we call it football. Uh, to, clear, to clear up for the uh, Americans, if you're watching. Um, this guy went in for a dirty tackle, a bit like Dale Stevens against Cardiff, um, a bit like Eto, I think it's against Birmingham, where his ankle hanged off, weren't a very nice sight. Um, and the referee did do nothing, and um, he went to VAR, 20 seconds later, he was off. Um, as I said, it's been used for offside goals, it's been used in the FA Cup over here, it's been used, as I've said, the World Cup, it's... You know, it's used in Bundesliga, La Liga, Serie A, I think. MLS is a world I just mentioned. We are the one of the last countries to actually give this a try. Um, I know some of your fans ain't going to be happy about it. For me, I'm delighted because I've said from the start of the season, it's, it's going to be needed. Um, the longer we delay it, the longer it's going to take us to get used to it. You know, it's all of them things that, you know, all... I really would have liked to send in this season. 
As I said, you can see the 20 Premier League clubs rolling behind me. Oh, fortunately, three of these clubs won't have VAR still next season. But as I've said in, earlier in this video, we don't know who that's going to be yet. So, you know, as I've said, gold 20, three of them won't have it, but AO. Um, but as I've said, I'm delighted. Guys, I hope you enjoy my new series. Um, you know, it's going to be one of I could come up, I could come, update you. Um, you know, guys, we've got a brilliant November coming to an end. We've got an exciting December for every football fan. Uh, wherever you're going, if you're on the road, please have a safe journey. Just in case I don't mention any more Premier League predictions videos. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, quick update. Give it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. And ciao for now.